this is an overview of our premium Smarty Document Manager plugin, uh, which extends the community version, um, a free document management plugin for WordPress. Once you install the premium and activate it, um, the interface is a little different. You have a better uh, file um, uploader. Uh, this is a um, Ajax uploader which supports file chunking and uh, unlimited file sizes. So if your host only allows a certain file size or you're blocked by a memory uh, restraint, um, this allows you to upload any file size. Um, so to upload a file, just click add file, choose the file, and um, you can choose to add uh, tags. and as well as notes and um, if you're using our group add-on you can notify users and once you're done with that you can, you can set the category and then uh, click start upload and um, this is a small file so it's going to upload pretty quickly um, so here we have our file and um, this just gives you some information about the file um, you can add a revision uh, you can add comments, and uh, if you use the groups add-on, you can have multiple users comment on the file. Um, every file has a download log to show you who downloaded that file, as well as an events log. An event, events log will show you who edited it, um, who added a revision, who, who looked at the file, who downloaded it. Um, is a share tab and uh, this tab allows you to share the file with uh, the outside um, network um, because uh, this is all under a user system but if you wanted to send that file out you could um, create a share link and set the time limit or uh, no time limit choose a password and click save and uh, it would generate a share link for you which you could then send send to somebody um, there's also an edit tab that allows you to edit the display name as well as uh, change the file and um, change the, the folder and the tags. Um, we do have a revision system so if you add a revision it's going to keep all the revisions in the history and you can and if you don't like the latest revision you can go back and remove a revision. Um, for supported file types, we have a preview, and that would be for uh, images, PDFs. Uh, we have a full PDF viewer. Um, different type of types of Google documents. We can we can preview uh, Word documents, PowerPoint, um, and that comes up right up in the previewer. Now, since this is a zip file, you can also choose to add more files to a zip file. Um, Say you wanted to just add files instead of re-uploading a whole new arch archive, you could do that using Add Files to Zip. Uh, Premium also gives you an advanced search, uh, so you can really find all the files within your system. Uh, you can search by date, category, extension, title. And we also give you a way to view recently uploaded files and most popular files. Um, folder nesting can go unlimited, so there isn't a limit there. You can just keep on um, adding uh, folders. And, and there is no limit here. Um, you can uh, remove the folder, edit the folder name, uh, get the folder URL if you wanted to share it internally. Um, we have commenting for folders. And there's also a folder log. Um, we have the groups uh, add-on enabled on this uh, installation. So if you have that extension, you can add users to this folder. And this is going to create a WordPress user and invite them to the folder automatically. You can do the same thing by attaching roles to this folder. Uh, we have our own group system. So on the back end, if you add a user to a group, you can add that group to this folder and anybody in that group is going to be able to use that folder. Same thing with BuddyPress and um, and this just allows you to 
edit the uh, settings of this group. So if you wanted to create a folder and you wanted to share it with multiple users, but you didn't want those users to view each other's files, you, you could enable that option here. Um, you can also apply the permissions of this folder to all the subfolders below it. And that's just a little about our groups add-on. Um, on the back end, there are various settings here uh, to, to format this the way you need it. Um, we have uh, mail settings. So for, for any function that uh, an email is dispatched, you can add an email for that here. So we have an admin email, user email. Um, there's an email if you're an admin and you upload a file to a user in the admin panel, then it's going to send an email to that user. We have that. We have uh, vendor emails. Uh, status notifications, comment notifications, adding files to a zip, revisions, um, sharing a public link, uh, groups. So on top of that, there, there are a bunch of settings here that um, could take time to go over in another video. Um, there, there's just, you, you can do pretty much anything with this document manager. Um, if you don't want a feature, most likely it's in here. You can just disable it. Um, and this is some links and media settings here. You can also manage your folders here. And this would be the same thing as the front end, but this is more from an admin view. You can share a folder with a group, uh, buddy press group roles and a folder. And that's, that's for the groups add on, which is an additional plugin. As an administrator, you can also access the user file manager, and this allows you to basically view any user um, like you or them on the back end. When files are deleted, they automatically go into a recycle bin, and when they're in the recycle bin, you can restore them, or you can empty the recycle bin and they'll, they will be deleted forever. And uh, we have a download log, which, which just has various information about uh, top files. Um, on this installation, we also have a forms add-on, which we can go over in another video. Um, this allows you just to build out forms and um, allow your users to submit those forms. And once they submit them, it uh, creates a PDF with that form. So we actually have um, a bunch of add-ons for this. You can view those add-ons by going to our website, smartypantsplugins.com, and clicking add-ons. Um, we have uh, a ton of feature upgrades. You can choose to uh, encrypt your files, and this is at-rest encryption, um, which is the most secure method you could use uh, because the file is encrypted on the server itself. Um, we have uh, OneDrive Importer, Google Drive Importer, Dropbox. Um, if you need to receive text alerts for, for files, well, we have an add-on for that that uses Twilio. Um, we have a tasks add-on that allows you to add a task to a folder, and you can set reminders to that task. Um, it comes with uh, a bunch of email options as well. And the form manager I went over a little earlier, you can just create forms and allow users to submit those forms. Uh, if you need a dashboard, um, this add-on gives you a, a dashboard to use that's separate from your uh, WordPress theme. Uh, the popular groups add-on, which is probably our most popular plugin that allows you to share folders with users, groups, roles, uh, buddy press groups. Um, if you're looking to offload your files and not store the files on your website, we have two different add-ons for that. We have the Google Drive offloader and the Amazon S3 offloader. And um, those come with their own settings. Amazon has uh, their own encryption settings there, so they would be encrypted on Amazon servers as well. And uh, finally, we have um, the upload uh, form shortcode. And this allows you to create a form on the front end that um, you can give to users to submit files to your folders. So if they're not a user, they could use that form to upload their own files and it would automatically insert into one of your folders. Um, it's a great way to receive documents and if you don't want to give users access to your website. So if you want to learn a little bit more about the add-ons, you can visit our website, click on each add-on. Uh, most of them have videos explaining the functionality 
or if you need to purchase premium you can do that as well on our website by clicking premium and clicking purchase and if you have any questions you can always reach us by by reaching us out reaching out and getting us on chat um, and you can also go to support.smartypantsplugins.com to find our documentation which we are constantly building um, so if you have a question you might be able to find it there and if not um, our chat is located right on that page as well um, our hours are usually 9 to 5 Monday through Friday Eastern Time and um, if you need anything let us know <laughs>